What's up guys, and today I'm going to be doing my first ride impressions review on the Honda Ruckus 2023. Um, and so, first I'm going to be saying like some things I like about it, and some things I don't. But to start off with some things I like about it, is that it goes way faster than other mopeds. Like, the other mopeds only do like 30, 35, and this one does like 45. Because I was doing like 43 the first time I rode it. I don't know, it just seemed... It's just fast. I like how it's faster than the other ones. And I do like how the gas tank is like right here on the underneath like the floorboard because then most of them have it here, which I like that it's there because then you have a bunch of storage here. But this bag right here, it was for my brother's motorcycle. It's like Kawasaki Z125. But since he has a backpack uh, and this gets in the way when he uh has his backpack on so he doesn't use it so i took the time to figure out how to mount it onto here but we do have a bag coming that goes right here underneath the seat which i think we might get rid of that when that the bag for under the seat shows up because wait this strap right here is probably going to get in the way um and another thing i like is that right here let me get the key quick is you put the key in then you can turn it and then you can like put your helmet strap in there and then just like lock it and so no one can it's a, like a helmet lock which is something nice that i like on this and um i'll start off with some things that oh one more thing that i do like is the front i would really like those front lights but then a couple things that i don't really like is that the horn is right here i feel like they could have hit it more maybe like tucked it back here in between the lights so then it, you can barely see it instead of it being above them. And uh, I do think that if they put disc brakes on it, they'd be a little better. Because these, the drum brakes are pretty good. They're just, well, they're not horrible, but they're also not the best. But, and another thing I don't like is how far this sticks out. It sticks out like four inches. I wish it just kind of like stopped right there. But, I don't know, it looks kind of weird to me. Because, like, maybe they could have, like, hmm, curved it a little bit more. I don't know. Um, and, hmm, and, I don't know. One thing I think is kind of weird with it is when you turn it on, and you turn on your blinkers, it clicks. But, like, even though... Like, I kind of feel like I wouldn't be able to hear it when I'm, like, coming up to a turn pretty fast. But you can hear it. Uh, when my brother was riding it, he was, he had the blinker on and I could hear it from, like, when we were coming. I was at the bottom of our driveway. Like, you can hear it loud and clear. And another thing I like is, because when you're on my brother's bike, when you have your arms here, like, on the mirrors, you can't, uh his like shoulder is like right here so you it like that's what it looks like on his pretty much and these are farther out so i like that uh because your arms aren't blocking the mirror which is nice and i do think they could have got it like a little bit better of a display this one's like kind of simple stripped down kind of there's like no extra features because you got a gas light for when you're low gas you got your light for when your brights are on and a blinker light and that's it well and you got your like odometer and it's like the same one that's in that uh 1998 chevy truck it's like the same kind of uh odometer that's in there but i do kind of like this metal look right here i i do like that metal but the grip seem fine and everything the drum brakes are pretty good you can still like they stop you pretty good better than i thought they would because on the raptor 90 that has drum brakes it does not stop you very good at all but this one's these got pretty good brakes which is what i like about this one and your horn's pretty loud i don't think it's as loud as uh the one on the z125 but it's still pretty loud but yeah i, I do like this front fender more than the back one because it sticks out well i mean not sticks out it's 
it doesn't have like a flat piece that comes out. It just it doesn't it's curved all the way, which is what I like better than the back one over here. That sticks out. That's flat. But yeah, overall, I think it's a really nice moped. It's faster than it's faster than like uh, I would say than like the Yamaha Zuma. I think that's what it's called. Yamaha Zoom Zoom Zuma. I think it's what it's called. And when you're starting it up, let me see if I can show you. But when I when you start it up, you can't really hear the starter. I don't know. Let me put it like. Ready? Like you can't really like you can't hear it at all. It's I don't know. It just seems weird. But I do like that color, like the tan color. Looks really nice. But and you got your spare kick. You got your Kickstarter. It's pretty nice too. I'll show you that. First kick. But. The center stand seems very sturdy. It doesn't seem like it would tip over at all. But I'm not sure if this is a front brake too, but it like you can lock it. And I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's just the rear brake because now the rear brake's locked. But if I feel like that would be so it wouldn't roll away. But if it's not the front brake too, then I think they should have changed it so then the front brake had this lock because your back tire is not even touching the ground. But... Here, let me pinch this, or pull it. Yeah, that's only the rear brake. The front one still spins. So, like, yeah, if you're on a hill, I think they should have put this on the front brake, so it wouldn't roll away. But, yeah, I think it's a really nice moped. Um, so far, I'd recommend it to you. Um, but I also haven't really ridden it, so I'll probably do, like, a 100-mile or a 1,000-mile review or something. Um... Because right now, the my Logan has ridden it the most, my brother. So it's got 40 miles. Otherwise, it would only have like 20. Because I took it up or gra the gravel road. And that's... I took it up the gravel road and down the road. But that's the only places I've taken it. But it seemed... It was a nice moped then. So I'd recommend it to you. But I think that's going to be it for this video. Make sure to go down, like, and subscribe. Comment if you want. Uh, you don't have to, but it's free, so. And you can always unsubscribe. But, otherwise than that, I'll catch you in the next one.